Hello, welcome to the Dope Show with Dopey. Um, the other day, I ate a hornet for the, finally, like the Holy Ghost had told me to do several things and I have usually followed what the Holy Ghost tells me to do. He told me to get horns tattooed on my head, so I did that. And then, um, he told me to eat a hornet because I used to call syringes hornets or bumblebees or fucking wasps, anything with stingers on them. And I have a thing for the, the insect itself, the hornets. And I'm just taking that as a sign. It was on my mom's back. Came from outside to, to her bathroom, and it was right there on the back of her shirt. I grabbed it, put it in my mouth, and chewed it up and swallowed it. I've been spit. I've been waiting three years to eat a fucking hornet, and it's finally happened. And I'm taking it as a holy sign. Uh, I'm totally trying to reamp myself back into the goat, and whatever time I got left here on this planet, I'm going to publish this book, man. This is scripture, dog. This is God told me one time when I was stoned what He thought of my uh, unholy Bible. He told me that it was the definition of the Holy Spirit. Or of the human spirit. It's the definition of the human spirit. But I just came across a fucking suicide note that I wrote that I put in here. I just thought I'd read it for the whole entire motherfucking world to see where I came from, man, and what I meant. And it's, it looks like something like this. I just got done reading it, and it's a very sad letter. Very sad. And on the top it says, I blame Jed Jewel. Death is my suicide note. Listening to Cattle Decapitation one last time. Shredder, I love you. You can have everything that I own that is death metal, shirts, hoodies, posters go to chronic. I have no justification. This book of lyrics is all I have to leave behind. I let a video, I left a video on my computer. I am sober, clear headed. I got a cord around my throat. I cannot live without weed. I fucked up. I can't fix, fix it. Hadn't seen Shredder in a week. I really want to die. I tried chronic. I gave people an hour. Then I'm jumping off my roof waiting for Cal Decapitation's monolith to stop playing. And then I'm jumping. Jed, you are a bitch for taking my brother from me and for ditching me. You were no longer my brother and weren't there when I needed you. Crotch Ripper, you were a beast. Sarah, thanks for being my friend. And I think that might be in Sarah Marburger. Joker, I love you. I don't believe in hell or God. Or should I say heaven? I am pretty for sure I'm done. I'm sick of being crazy. I needed love and still empty. Smoking a lot of cigs. Of being exquisitely empty. Shannon England, I do not love you. And Mackenzie Hardy, I do not love you. Either mom... I am sorry. Do not resuscitate. That was a fucking suicide note that I wrote so many years ago, and I had a microphone cord wrapped around my throat, and I was hanging on my roof waiting for it, listening, listening to Cal Decapitation's monolith in, in humanity. And once it was done, I was going to jump off my fucking uh, roof with the microphone cord around my throat, but two junkies came over and saved my life and got me high. And got me off the fucking uh, roof and suicidal thought. But that's how dark I was, man. There's a lot of evil, holy shit in here. And I decided the whole world should hear this story that I got, man. I'm the go to God. I'm a prophet. We are living in some weird times, dude. I'm still not fully healthy. I still struggle with shit going on in my chest, man. I'm still having trouble getting high and stoned. I, I was perfectly all right, but then I fucked it up by doing dope. And I think three months from now, I'll be able to smoke weed again, and then I'll be a monster. But things are happening for my 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 band, Go Grinder. It's on it's on the back burner. Go Grinder's on the back burner. But I'm working with this dude. I like to call him Donnie Darko. He's rich. 
he's 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 got this black core band scene that he's doing we're buying this drummer lord marco you may have heard of him <laughs> so i'm gonna be working with lord marco dude one of the best professional death metal drummer bands that are in there his application on his facebook is 30 bands motherfuckers drum for 30 motherfucking bands all of them i love he's a blast beast machine from hell but yeah, man, I went through hell, dog. And then I've been through holy places and shit. I read a lot of stuff down on paper that I think a lot of people find interesting. And it's my proverbs. It's my psalms. It's uh, the book of horns. That's what I want to call it. The go to God, the book of horns. And then eventually I'll do my second. I got a whole nother trapper to or shoebox full of lyrics and then I'll do a second trapper one, so I'm done with this one. And that one's going to be called the Book of Hoofs for the goat. I am the goat of God. I leave this precious flock, the unholy hearth I walk. I will never stop. I will never stop.